G'day guys, it's Captain Carter, and welcome back to another episode in our Cold Waters playthrough. Uh, if you're new to the playthroughs and you haven't watched the others before, I suggest you go back and do that. But if not, here's a quick teaser of uh, what we're up to. We're doing the Russian side of the campaign. So this is available in the Playable Subs mod, which you can get on Subsim... Uh, subsim.com? Yeah, Subsim.com. Um, and this unlocks the Russian submarines for you, as well as a couple of custom missions, uh, custom single-player missions, and a custom campaign. Uh, so, our mission for today's episode is going to be uh, intercepting an enemy task force with landing ships. And they're going to be heading to Andoya in Norway. So, stick around, and we'll see if we can't track these buggers down. Righto, we are making all best speed back through the UK Iceland Greenland gap. Um, hopefully, without getting bloody caught. And we need to go sit off the coast of Andoya now. They're going to have landing ships floating around here. And I'm going to reckon. Well, I think we just intercept the first one and we just see if we can't track them. Rightio, we have a new sounder contact bearing 244. Four. Designate Sierra 1. First things first. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Here is our Alpha, the Tiger. Now we've already got a pretty good ident on this on this submarine. Now I know it's a submarine contact because we saw the little picture on the map and it was a little picture of a submarine. So we've just got to line up our waterfall chart here. Con sonar. It's a walrus. Is classified as submerged submarine. Radio, and he's already hitting. Jesus Christ! Yep. In from Sierra well, Island. guess what, buddy? I know exactly where you are. Radio, dive, make your depth fourteen hundred feet. Con sonar, Sierra one. One, he's cavitating here yeah, because he heard that. Righto. And I'm going to cavitate like shit too. Con sonar. We are cavitating. Not a problem. I already know exactly where he is. Gone fire control. We've lost the wire. Cheeky bugger used a bloody active sonar ping to locate me. Yeah, you sneaky bastard. We are going to go deep. And he's still pinging away on the active right as well. Two. Two, four, eight, helm, I, con, sonar, oh, yeah. to active search. Two can play this game, dude. Con, helm, con, sonar, no longer cavitating. Bingo. Con, sonar, switching to passive search. Found you, you little prick. And his problem is he's going to be cavitating, so I don't know how well he's going to be able to hold me as contact for very long. He does know exactly where the hell I am. And that makes me very, very nervous. Ship for ultra quiet. So I'm going to slow down and hopefully... Hope to God that going quiet... Make depth one, six, zero, zero feet, die by. We'll throw him. Oh God, his torpedo's way off. Ah, uh, he was going on my initial track, which was down there that way. Ha ha. He's got no idea where I am now. I fortunately know exactly where he Con, is. Torpedo room, tube four ready. <laughs> Sucker. Blue where I am. One, six, zero, zero feet, die by. Con, torpedo room, tube six ready. Now, I don't know if my torpedo is actually going to grab Con, him. torpedo room, tube seven ready. Probably not. I reckon my torpedo is just Con, missed. torpedo room, tube eight ready. Bugger it. Righto. Where are we? Let me see. You're going to go shallow. Shoot, shoot. 
And we're going to snap that torpedo off in his general direction super damn quick. The view part is that torpedo is going to run deep until it pretty much gets right on top of him. And this is going to go straight up, lock straight onto him, and then he's going to be dead. He's still trying to get me. Oh no, he's got me on the active sonar now. Now I'm going to cheat here because I'm going to actually send this torpedo active much sooner than what he expects me to. Does know exactly where I am. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Hello, little walrus. Bad news for you, dude. Well, oh, good news is he snapped the torpedo off there. I'm hoping he's still got no idea where the hell I am. There's my torpedo over there. Um, what we're gonna do? Shoot two five. Aye, sir. We're gonna throw that out the side. And then we're going to run my kill. Make turns for four, six knots, maneuvering eye. We are going to run like hell. And just to make sure and certain, Gone fire come right to two nine five helm eye. We're going to wheel around, and we're going to put Con some massive helm, amount of distance. Now he can he can hear me on his passive sonar and he's hearing me better because I'm speeding up so I'm making a whole shit ton of noise. The thing is he turned that and fired that torpedo out behind him, which means theoretically he shouldn't have control on its wire. Theoretically though, he could still kill me. But you know, let's let's hope that doesn't happen. Sonar, noisemaker, bearing, two, eight, eight. Rig ship for ultra quiet. And now we're gonna go ultra quiet. Nice and deep. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra one. Last bearing. Well, two, he's dead. Eight, five. Contact breaking up. My problem now is. Oh, he's short range activated his torpedo. Are you kidding me? He must have. That's my moss. That's his torpedo. Well, he's still got a torpedo. Oh, that's the one running on the surface. Oh, I don't care about that one. That's my moss. That's his torpedo, which is now going to hit him and sink him again. You tried to dodge it, dude, but you just you just couldn't. It's actually sinking so damn quick that it can't actually that he can't can't keep up with it. Um, look, let's let's just do the smart thing here. Uh, due Come south. Left to one eight zero helm I. And accelerate like hell. And hope that his torpedo finishes him off. Make turns for four six knots maneuvering I. That's the beautiful thing about the Alpha. It is just so. Ridiculously quick, 46 knots underwater. This thing is a goddamn weapon. Oh, still weapons nearby. Come on. In insert elevator theme music here, or elevator music. This is about the only part that sucks. You should be able to just leave the mission as soon as you know you, you've you've completed your mission objective. Which for us was sinking this walrus, which wasn't our mission objective. But you know what? We had some fun while doing it. So thank you very much for watching today's episode, guys. I do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, leave a like on this video if you liked it. Leave a comment as well if you've got any questions, queries, comments, or you just want to say hi. Hello. And also, don't forget to hit that big ol' subscribe button. 
uh, does all sorts of cool things for you and me. Um, and uh, I think, well, I think I'll just uh, see you as a winner.